Hello there once again, this is David. Uh, I'm going to continue off from the last video. If you haven't seen the last video on how to hack health, annotation will be at the top right screen. Uh, check it out. Good video. You want to know how to hack health? Great. If you already did, let's get started into AGI. Alright. Again, sorry for the small screen. I'm going to be using che Cheat Engine 6.3. Alright. So once again, Java. Alright. That's what you're going to want to choose. Now, you see how my guy's AGI says 30 right there? So I'm going to go ahead and type in 30. Boom. Alright. Now what I'm going to do to change it is take off his bow. Now, now he has zero, which is what we're going to hack it to. So, zero. Alright, still haven't found the one address. Put it back on. We got 30 now. Boom, there's his one address. Just to change it, let's check it out. Just make sure it is the address. Sure is, change to zero. So, we're going to put it back on. Make sure the weapon is on. Stupid ads, man. Alright, now, double click it. And of course, you're going to see it down here. Back to find out what access is this address. And yes, for the debugger. Now, if you see two MOV, the brackets next to the MOV, if you see two of them, choose the top one. This one just has one, sometimes it has two. It'll be the top one if it has two. So, go ahead and hit show disassembler. I want to click up two times. One, two. Now, uh, you do see three now. Let's, let's try this. Top MOV, MOV, ESI as it shows down here. Uh huh. Trauma zero. So that's what you're going to want to change it to. Yes. Now close everything out because it's going to be really laggy. Now, as you can see, my uh, AGI is zero, zero to forty. So he's going to be shooting quicker. But we're going to want to hack the other side. Okay. So let's do that. Let me open Cheat Engine again. Alright. I always refresh Cheat Engine when doing this. Just for lag issues. Um, as you can see, we have 40. 40. Now we're going to change it. Now that 0. 0. Again with ads. Stupid ads. Okay. Sorry, you probably didn't see the ad it just pop up in the background. Okay, now we're back at 40. Alright, as you can see, you can either wait for them to change. Alright, now, process of elimination. This is it right here, because these two are no longer 40. So, find out accesses, yes. Uh, bracket next to the MOV, you want to choose that one. Show disassembly. So, as you can see, there's the MOV and J80. Replace with code that does nothing. Boom. Replace with code that does nothing. Boom. Now for this top MOV. If you don't understand, if you still don't understand how to do this, you always type in MOV. Now, mine says EAX. If yours says EBX, ESI, whatever it says, type that. Mine says EAX, so I'm going to put EAX. And zero. Make sure to always put the comma, otherwise it may not work. Now close everything. And as you can see, I have two zeros. Now, check out check out what happens. Boom! Alright, sorry for the little bit of lag. Let's move to the next level. Let's uh, move them over. You can do this with any character. You can do it with the gladiator. You can do it with the priest. You can even do it with the magician. What I like doing with the priest is hacking all of his, his attack, AGI, and range. So every character, every enemy immediately dies right as you move into the next level, which I may release a video on. But there was one thing. You cannot hack these three things right here. You cannot hack those. I have tried. I've tried bunches of different things. 
it's very complicated you cannot hack them so if you're wanting to hack range you just hack the range attack same with that because you can see how the attack changes in the range and whatnot but anyway I hope you guys have had a great time uh, I'll see you guys later thanks for watching uh, I hope this helps remember to rate comment and subscribe and uh, bye guys